Hi guys, my name is Tito. On this channel, I do movie reviews and I also talk about relationships. And recently I was listening to the Feminine Expressions podcast. Great podcast, by the way. And um, the topic was deep conversations and how nowadays in the dating scene, people aren't really trying to get to know each other anymore. These days, it's just about, you know, hookup culture. And on the podcast, the ladies eventually start talking about men and they ask the question if men not being willing to have deep conversations with women nowadays if that actually stems from men's unwillingness to be open and vulnerable and that ultimately led me to another question which i'm going to try and answer in this video which is why don't men want to be vulnerable in the talking stage or when dating or even in relationships now before i answer that question let's have a quick listen to part of the conversation that started all this and even the ones that think that they are Deep, deep quote unquote of mm. profound they still don't have the ability to really delve so i don't in my experience they don't actually want the connection and the intimacy that i'm seeking which is why i haven't even been able to lay with anybody for do for you years. think that the fact the fact that they're not able to delve into that depth has something to do with them not wanting to be vulnerable yeah now first of all let me say that it's true men don't like being vulnerable with multiple women because we don't want too many women knowing our deepest darkest secrets or the things that make us tick for the fear that if things were to end badly with that woman or if we were to ghost her that does happen sometimes um she's not out there in the world with sensitive information about us and you know upset with us at the same time because as the saying goes hell hath no fury like a woman scorned so what many men would actually prefer would be to be open vulnerable and connected with a wife or a girlfriend rather than just you know people that we go on dates with because with a wife or a girlfriend they'll be a whole lot more discreet and respectful of your private and sensitive information so it's not necessarily that we don't want to be vulnerable we just don't want to be vulnerable with everybody because, you know, with a wife or a girlfriend, they will be around for the long haul and there's more trust there, so to speak. And it's just ironic that these days when it comes to dating or going on dates, especially in the early stages, women tend to want to establish an emotional connection up front, while men tend to want to establish a physical connection up front. We appear to want different things. While a woman wants to be deep with a guy, a guy wants to be deep in a woman i'm sorry i couldn't resist <laughs> but back to vulnerability it appears that um, vulnerability and emotional intimacy comes way easier to women than physical intimacy does but with men it's the other way around uh, with men physical intimacy comes easier to us while um, emotional intimacy and vulnerability is harder for us and i'm not saying that that's right i'm just saying that that appears to be the way things are or have been lately or have things always been that way but bringing it back to why men find it hard to be vulnerable i think there are two categories of men here there are the ones i mentioned earlier who only want to be vulnerable with their girlfriend or with with their wife somebody that they feel that they can trust and who'll be around for the long haul and then there's another category of men men who are very rigid and very traditional who don't even want to be vulnerable with a wife or a girlfriend because maybe they have trust issues or because they feel like being vulnerable will make them look like less of a man somehow yeah so i think that's why men aren't vulnerable with women and i think that's how it affects our ability to have deep conversations and deep connections with women what's the solution um maybe men can be better at communicating why they are not vulnerable with a woman at least you know let her know why you're not opening up to her so that's one thing and another thing could be maybe for women to understand or try and understand that men dispense vulnerability a bit differently than women do for instance where vulnerability is concerned a a man there are things that a man will not share with a woman he's in the talking stage with but he'd comfortably share those things you know with a girlfriend also there are things that he may not share with a girlfriend but he would share with a woman that he's engaged to be married to also there may be there may be things that he'd not share with a fiance but he'd share with the woman when she becomes his wife so i think th those are some of the ways that some men graduate as far as you know vulnerability is concerned some men not all men 
Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're watching this on YouTube where the magic happens, then please remember to like this video by clicking on the like button and subscribe to my channel as well by clicking on the red subscribe button. I've also got other videos like this, so please feel free to look around.